before we get to that, I do want to talk about the Tag Team GXs because we finally learned what the secret rares are going to look like, and oh my gosh, I love them. They are pretty, aren't they? They are. See, I love, when we, back in the EX era, um, you had like the normal half art and then you had the full art cards. Each one had a, still had its own unique style. I wasn't a huge fan of when we went to GX's and every full art looked exactly the same and every secret art was just a rainbow rare. I get why it would look cool in a collection kind of sense, like if you're flipping through Binder and you just see all these rainbow Pokemon. It but does it also, look cool. it feels like a lack of originality to me though. Yeah, I suppose so. Uh, I but with these I... tag team GX's, we don't know. Uh, I guess we don't know yet if they're coming in just half art and secret rare yet. Like, is there going to be a full art version? I don't know. But I the wouldn't... secret rares have custom artwork, and uh, we've only have we we seen uh, how many have we seen? Because I know we saw Venusaur and Celebi. Four, is that the only one? As far one? as I'm aware. Which ones have we seen? Oh, we saw uh, Mimikyu Gengar, right? Uh, yeah, Mimikyu Gengar, uh, Celebi Venusaur, Eevee and Snorlax, and Magikarp and Waylord. Okay, yeah, I don't think I remembered some of them, but the fact that it's just, it's custom, even cooler artwork. Um, I, the only downside I could see is, like, I could see why someone would just be content with the half art, if that's what we're still going to be calling them, because they still look amazing. Mm -hmm. um, while the, the Secret Rares is just an alternate picture, essentially. Yeah, so I've, I've, I've sent you a link to to the, the Secret Rare ones. So, which of those do you think is your favorite of the, of the four that's been leaked? Um, which one's which one is your favorite? Just like purely on ter in terms of art. I was looking in the wrong place for the link, so I'm opening that right now. Okay, yeah. so oh gosh, I forgot how cool the uh, Waylord Magikarp one is. Yeah. Uh, I gotta go Waylord Magikarp. I just, yeah, I, love I have that. to agree with you. We'll probably make a video of this part of uh, this podcast on YouTube. So if you guys are watching on YouTube, you should be seeing the art right now. I do really like the Selby Venusaur one though. I like the Selby Venusaur more than the normal art. Yeah, I do too. I wasn't a huge fan of the Celebi Venus on normal art. Um, uh, not what a huge I really, fan of the Eevee Snorlax one, to be honest. See, I was going to say the opposite. Like, you like I it love more? it. It's pretty cool. Um, it's Eevee and Snorlax just eating some eating some food. Just pigging out. And it looks kind of like... Um, I, don't want to, I don't want to insult the artist by saying it looks like a kid drew it, but it looks... It does, doesn't it? It looks like it looks a kid It cartoony. Drew. Yeah, like very childish kind of. Like yeah, art, exactly. But well done, child art. Yeah, they've all got they've all got very different art styles, all four of them. Which I, I think that's one of the good things because the normal GXs are all being drawn by the same person, so this is giving uh, a bit of a different feel to the other GXs, uh, the other variations yeah. of it. Yeah, that's true. I don't. Is it, is it the same person or is it like a company that they outsource it to? Because it's um for five what I band tell, graphics, I, right? I don't. I don't think that's who's doing the normal ones. Uh, I don't know about the, I, the tag teams, but like just regular GXs, it's five bank no, graphics. No, the, the tag team ones are all drawn by the same person. The oh, I don't ones. know. Possibly, yeah. Um, uh, so yeah, yeah I, it's I, nice that there's a big variety like that. Then. Yeah, I'm. I don't really care much about the Mimikyu Gengar one. It feels very generic. Yeah, it it does. It feels very. It's, I think it's because there's not much going on. I think like it's supposed got, to be in the woods, like all spooky and stuff. Yeah, but. it's got very plain background, and while. Like the Whale of Magikarp one also has a plain background. Like the stuff, the, the, it's funny. Like Magikarp's being sharp in the air. Well. It's, it's cool. Yeah. It's funny. Yeah. But Mimikyu and Gengar, they're just being creepy in the woods. Yeah. The Venusaur Selby one looks really cool. I also yeah. do like that one's all 3D ish. Mm -hmm. The Magikarp Wayward is very flat color. The Eevee and Snorlax, as we said, there's a lot of variety in the Secret Rares. has like that kind of childlike look to it. Um, and then Gengar and Mimikyu is just boring. Yeah. Still but like it, but I don't know if it's gonna become over here. But there's sleeves of the Mag Magikarp Wayward one. Oh, and that looks cool. Yeah, yeah. I'm it's all not for the that. same art, is it? Yeah, it is. It is. It just it's, it's, it's just it's, slightly it's modified. Different, probably yeah, it's you know, a without different the blue. And stuff. That's what it is. Is it? It's a different uh, blue on the sleeves. It's a darker blue, I think. It might be the um. There's like a border on the sleeves. That might be what's messing with you. I don't know. Because I think the blue of the water. Not a. Yeah, I'm looking at it side by side. It's definitely different. Well, jeez, uh, being a hater. I'm not being a hater. I'm not being a hater. I'm not being a hater. I'm just saying two different <laughs> colors are different. 
they may have had to change it for how it prints. Uh, but yeah. that is not the only secret rare that we know of because we did see Erica's hospitality. That's not secret rare, actually. Oh, uh, well, whatever. The it's trainers don't get trainer. secret rares. The full art. What? Now, I uh, actually, they feel like item secret cards rares. are trainers and they do get secret rares. Okay, the supporters. Supporter don't. cards don't get secret rares. God. But the full arts feel like secret rares. Okay. To me, anyways. I don't know if anyone else feels different. I know they're technically not classed that way, but when I pull a fart trainer, I feel like I just pull a secret Did rare. you call it a fart trainer? A full art trainer. A <laughs> that's fart not trainer. What, that's not what I heard. <laughs> fart is short for full art. <laughs> don't be a hater. <laughs> <laughs> the fart traders okay well you said we just found a new most expensive <laughs> card when you showed me that <laughs> oh, he's a fart trainer um I'd... yeah i think i think honestly i think erica's hospitality is gonna be i think it's gonna push past cynthia for the most expensive for lot trainer right right but we're also getting to cynthia with the garchomp card yeah yeah i think I like think the Erica's second gonna... version of Lily is way more expensive than the first Lily. Yeah, it really is. I think Erica's going to be... Yeah, Erica's going to beat the current Cynthia. I don't know if it'll beat the Cynthia with a Garchomp. That's really good. I love that new really Cynthia. It is really good, yeah. But I'm telling you, none of them are as good as the Magikarp and Waylord guard. Yeah, yeah. It is oh, you're telling I, me I that just like that a picture no. of Erica standing there... No, and no, I'm, no, I'm saying here. like Cynthia and Garchomp maybe, but Waylord and Magikarp is cool. I do, I love it. I really, I really want these tag teams just to have in my binder. 